morning guys welcome to today today is Sunday and it's moving day for our horses it's a super sad day for me I'm so stressed out today is December the 1st and you know what that means it means that our elf on the shelf is back and even though our kids are a little old for Elfie he still comes on December the 1st sits in our tree and watches over us but today on the first day of December he always brings us our advent calendars so he got us like are you excited? Yes. I've said this before, but this elf has been in our family since my boys have been little. And literally, we had an elf on the shelf that watched us over us and our behavior at Christmas for like 25 years. This this guy's been in our family for forever, and I we love him. I know most of you guys know what a Schleich advent calendar is. An advent calendar is a countdown to Christmas Eve. Or, and each one of these boxes, see there's number one, you open them, and inside is a special surprise. Well, the first one, Gabby already opened hers. It was this gorgeous lady. Is that a lady? I'm assuming she's so yeah. pretty. And so now every single day, they will open up one of these boxes. Number two is right here. And by Christmas Eve, they will have opened every single thing that is on this box. She yeah. is beautiful. <laughs> I need um, a pop socket. I don't have any more pop sockets. I gave them all away. Dad needs to order me some. Use the last one. I know, even I don't have a pop socket, but I'm just glad that some of our subscribers have them. The girls both want this for Christmas, but we can't get it in Canada right now. They both want it. It's the house, kind of like a Barbie house, but a Schleich house for horses and horse people. And it has a barn on the side of it. They both want it so bad. I wanted to buy that for them so bad. Um, this is the cafe. And they both want that, but Sophie actually wanted something else as well. So Santa might bring these. But yeah, imagine being a imagine a world where you could ride your horse up to the coffee shop, tie it up to the hitching post, and then sit down outside and have your coffee. So that is what sh the Schleich Advent Calendar is all about. This is not a paid advertising. I just wanted to show you guys. I I even want one. I'm gonna spill the tea. I'm gonna spill the tea that you guys might not know about me. Some secrets that you guys might not know about me. But here it is. To be happy, I have to have all the conditions have to be, oh my gosh, the snow is starting. We're in a time rush now. But anyway, uh, I have to have everything exactly right to be happy. So I take extra pains every single day. I get enough sleep. I eat the right way. I do all the things I know that I need to be happy and be positive. And that's why it's easy for me because I always see the snow. Oh gosh, we're expecting a blizzard. Anyways, so... No, it it's so cold outside today and to be on being cold is a big trigger for me like I cannot be cold I can't find my snow pants you guys. I've been freezing all morning. We're moving the horses right now and I'm gonna be frozen. I don't know how to get warm. Kaylee those socks are not warm I have like socks built into my hunters like fuzzy okay, ones. So they're right. like winter boots. All right. Once a mom always a mom. If you come to my house I'll be your mom. Anyway, my my snow pants are missing. I'm stressed. Are you stressed? Are you stressed? No. The, the, the rush is on. Sam is out. We're supposed to get a massive blizzard all day, and the snow has already started. Snow so, yeah. day on lunch. Yeah, tomorrow will be a snow day for um, the kids. Well, Kaylee's getting braces tomorrow. Oh. Braces. Can we tell them? Yeah. So what's happening to you tomorrow, Kaylee? I'm getting braces. Kaylee's getting braces. So exciting. Yeah. <laughs> Flips Macy over Macy. Ugh. Macy's like a, a rag doll. Mm -hmm. All right, we have to go down to the barn and pack everything up so that when Dad gets here, we're ready to roll. Throw the girls food. You ready? Yeah. You ready? <gasps> I'm not ready. I got no snow pants. Okay, so I got their bowls and I also have these. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with them. I feel like my snow pants could be in this van, but there's so much junk. And I can't find them. They're not here, you guys. What am I going to do? Warm mittens, though. Don't judge our van. You know you want to. Oh, where's the other warm mitten? Huh? It's horrible! It's a blizzard! My snow pants better be in Sam's truck. Okay, so this is what I did this morning. I have buckets. This is the AM bucket. 
and I wrote on there, small bags are fins, bigs are storm. This is AM. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put, these are fins morning grain. The problem is oh, that, that it doesn't matter. Those are fins. It doesn't matter what it says on it. They're used, reused bags. All the small ones are fins. All the big ones are storms. But the problem is, but look, I think I accidentally overdid some bags or underdid some bags. So now I have to figure that out because two bags are massive and the rest are not. All right, so this is their morning bin. Storm gets this bag. Finn gets this bag, even though it says Stella on it. Um, and then we have the same over here for nighttime, and that's all they have to do. Stella then we bag. have our treats. We have our feed pans. All right, let's go. Everybody grab something. <laughs> Taylor, take one. Oh my God. Take one. Take one. You are, my kids are like the queens of easy. So mama will carry these heavy suckers. Hi. I am not about to give up on my snow pants. I know they're somewhere. Like, they were hanging on the banister where I keep them always, and then I looked to see if I threw them in the laundry to wash them, and I don't see them. I did end up putting too much grain in two bags this morning. I'm stressed, you guys. This is me, real and stressed, because. Our new barn is outdoor board unless we want to go in muck stalls every day and I don't want to go in muck stalls every day. So I agree to that and now it's a blizzard and there's no way in heck my horses are staying outside in a blizzard. Like, like it just can't happen. So now I'm going to go in the morning and muck stalls because I just, you know, before, I'm already going to cry. Like I'm already going to cry and we haven't even taken them yet. When we used to board our horse, it was easy to forget about them. It was easy like to not think about any of this stuff because somebody else is taking care of them. But now that we've had them at home and we've loved them at home and they've loved being at home, like I just worry. I, I know that they're fine to go to another place. It's just that Mom, we're having too much fun. I feel like nobody's gonna take care of them the way that we do. All right, so we brought the horses in while we get ready to go. Do you guys have to fill hay bags? Where are they? I like how we... Where do you think they are? Down like here? No. Nope. We're not very organized. At all. Do you guys know what halters you're going to bring for the horses? I the ones that are on. I know, but they have to have halters there so that we can hang them up. She's having that one. That's the halter. No, he needs another halter because somebody else is going to be riding your horse and leading him and his halter. Do you want them to use that good one? <laughs> oh, we're all going to cry. <laughs> Sophie not be, Sophie's not feeling so happy. You hear that, Finn? Your days of being the boss are numbered. Can you tell I'm a little stressed? <laughs> Kaylee's like, I've never seen this side of you. Um, okay, so you're taking Lemieux and you're taking Rainbow. You're taking back. Blue. Why don't you take the Rainbow? He looks so cute in Rainbow. All right, you have a um, uh, rope. He's using the one that you was using. You don't want them to go to another barn and look like ragamuffins, and people say like, and people be like, oh, who's that horse that doesn't even have a nice halter? <laughs> like, clearly, I feel guilty that we're banishing them. Yeah, that matches. She's stressed. I'm stressed. But what halter is that? His first ever That's halter his old halter. halter. His first ever. I should have washed it. I could have washed that yesterday. We should have oh. planned yesterday. All right. Uh, let's get hay bags and fill them up. Maybe I should eat something because this is not going to go well. This is not going to go well because I have to be tough for my kids. Are you excited? Am I excited? Yeah. Yeah? Why? Why? Why are you excited? Why not? Because we're taking our horses someplace they've never lived before and they're going to be without us. No, Sometimes when I'm stressing out, the best thing to do is just think about something different because it's the only thing that will calm me down. We yeah, we need to go. Alright. As long as you got the food and hey, we're good. 
Guys, that's what it's been in 10 minutes. 10 minutes of snow. It's gonna be bad. I'm not gonna lie, I hate this a lot. I hate that this has to happen so that my kids can ride their horses and that my horses don't just sit in the field all, all winter, but I hate it. So we're moving. We're looking for another farm faster than ever now. So this is their hay that we're gonna leave there. So we are feeding our own hay. We're taking our own hay there because, because we're, I'm a control freak. <laughs> I'm a control freak. So yeah, we're taking our own hay there. And guys, this is probably gonna be my biggest meltdown on camera ever. So be prepared, <laughs> be prepared for this. One, I'm gonna probably be the frozen, most frozen I've ever been. And two, oh here they come. I've been lost far too end of an era even though it was not an era it's like the end of happiness the amazingness the most awful day on earth back on me it seems brother help me up i've fallen down have you ever felt like someone who's meant to be somewhere else caught inside a state of mind where nothing is really making sense that's why i've been left here on the ground sister help me up i've fallen I've been lost far too long I can't see I'm trapped in darkness Life has turned it back on me it would seem Brother, help me up I fell. So down. I fell taking the grain into the trailer. You that fell? Was, yeah. So the reason that we're going there, so we don't ever have to drive our horses there in this kind of weather again. And it's gonna be good. I know it's gonna be good, right? It's gonna be good. Kaylee, are you surprised to see me in an emotional mess? Yeah. You are? You're supposed to say no. Of course not. This is a sad no, thing. Of not. <laughs> and I can't find my snow pants. The fi not finding of my snow pants was the thing that set me off the most, I feel like, because I, it's hard for me to not be warm. Brother, help me up, I've fallen down. We missed the window to leave early enough before the snow hit. Sam went to get a snow blower. Did you get a snow blower for the tractor? Just a regular snow blower? Oh. Guys, this is scary. We've already rolled into traffic once, slid into traffic. It's scary when you have horses. The part that's hard for me is that, like I was saying to Fiona, she's like, stop talking. You're feeding your own self negativity. And I'm like, it's a negative situation. But it's not, it's a positive situation. It's for the best, I get that. But there are so many things that we do to make our horses happy. That I don't tell you guys because you'll be like, why do you do that? But I don't know what he's gonna do it for them. Like, the storm's not gonna let Finn in the shelter. So when it gets cold, we bring them in. Like when it gets really bad, we just bring them in so that Finn can be happy too. And there's only one bucket, so they put their, their hay in a bucket and Storm won't let Finn eat. They have to have their own piles. And if they have their own piles, it's gonna blow, blow away. Like in this weather, it's just gonna blow away. And there's not gonna be anybody there to go get it for them. <laughs> yeah, it's so sad for me. I think God is making me afraid for our lives by the weather to get me out of the sadness. You guys know how I tell you that I dream stuff in the future. Well, I dream stuff like 10 and 20 and 30 years in the future. And, and it sometimes it can seem crazy, but 
but these are the things that actually happen and sometimes they give me sometimes the dreams that I have make me feel comforted and sometimes they make me feel stressed out but and sometimes they make me feel safer so the last week or so I've been talking about how Gabby always says she's terrible with kids but she's actually really good with kids and I think she enjoys it even though she tries to be tough and she acts she says she hates children anyway so I've been talking about that and saying things like that and two nights this week I dreamed the future with Gabby I dreamed her with a husband and he's amazing and and Gabby in the future is kind and easy going you guys she's easy going and she's a little boy and she's a little girl and I the second dream that I had the first dream I had was with her and her husband at the mall and her father-in-law is a crazy guy and that's what I dreamed and then the second dream I dreamed was me taking care of her little girl at her house and talking to her husband and her husband oh, he is handsome and he's clean cut which is exactly the kind of guy that Gabby likes and he's putting on a suit to go to work and I was like oh he's so handsome and she has a little girl and I'm there taking care of her so having those dreams and knowing that that's gonna happen in the future makes me know that I'm not gonna die today on these bad roads <laughs> so yeah sometimes having dreams like that help For real god has given me terror to replace the sadness <laughs> oh my gosh we were going sam has his four oh, nicely changed. his what do you do you have your four ways on we're, we're almost there so sam was going really 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 slow and a car came through an intersection he didn't even try to slow, stop probably because he knew he was going to slide he saw us and still went through the intersection and we were going if sam had been going any bit faster sam had put on the brakes in the ice like Literally, I was like this, praying. What were you guys doing? <laughs> My heart was I didn't see it. I only I saw, saw part where we him. almost hit him and he just went like that and we oh. went. So this. I saw none of it other than him there because I just closed my eyes. I do not want to see, I do not want to see it. Is there a focus on Gabby getting married and having babies? Okay, Gabby? No. Welcome to Canada, you guys. Welcome to Canada. This is what it's like. I wish I had brought my tripod. But just think of all the videos that we're gonna make here, you know? Making it here safe and sound. Thank you, God. I'm, I'm now grateful instead of sad. I've been running round in circles Chasing my tail and lost my way Seeking shelter in different corners Never finding a place to stay Somehow ended up here on the ground Brother, help me up, I've fallen down I know that I've heard the ones that I'm sorry if I make you guys cry. It can't be helped. On the answers, drinking till my feet felt numb, just like Father did. Their first night, they're gonna want to be like running all around and acting crazy, and um, with the blizzard, that's not gonna be awesome. I would better throw some shavings in here too. What do you think, Stormy Boy? You think I don't care? I got my hay. I'm trapped in darkness. Life has turned it back on me, it seems. Brother, help me up. I've fallen down. Have you? Ever felt like someone who's meant to be somewhere else? Caught inside a state of mind where nothing is really making sense. That's why I've been left here on the ground. Sister, help me up. I'm falling. I've been lost far too long I can't see I'm trying
trapped in darkness Life has turned it They literally don't care. They're like, yeah, I got warmth and food. Who cares? Are you enough for tonight, the food, or do you get more yeah. later? They're gonna get their nighttime. Isn't this lunch? You only gave them breakfast, right? Right. Got their food in their bucket. Got their hay and some shavings. We already filled their stalls with shavings. But yeah, this is it. Falling down. Brother, help me up. I've fallen down. Our trailer is won't close. Everything's frozen and we can't get it closed. Alright, we are headed up this hill. Everybody's holding their breath, but we did it. Sam. off to go shopping because they ate in the car on the way here they were starving that time when you're so hungry and you're gonna go and eat but you can't even wait because your blood sugar is so low and then you eat and then you don't eat when you go out yeah that's what happened so then um, Sam and I are gonna eat but you know like when you so we went home and I changed my coat I changed my boots I washed my hands so I wouldn't be stinky but you know those days when you like are like okay let's just go to the mall I'm not dressed the way I would normally go to the mall and then Maybe I just, hopefully, hopefully I won't see anybody. Yeah. I got army leggings on. Yeah, that, that's what I, uh, at the mall. So I don't want to meet anybody here, but yeah, this will be the day I see everybody. Hey girl. Will you find anything you guys want? Yeah, I have Oh, actually, now you want food? Yeah. No, let's go to get you a pair of jeans and let Kaylee no, pick out a Christmas first. present. In our family, Kaylee, I suck at presents, so I let people pick out what they want. Okay. You want to do it? Kaylee yeah. wants food first. Let's get food. Do you actually really want food first? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, you guys are annoying. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do it. guys we closed them all we literally closed them all we're locked in we got one thing a pair of jeans for Christmas and for sushi. Gabby and sushi locked in everything is closed we got locked no in we got no locked Sam's in probably do you see your dad no uh oh he messaged me too but I was too busy what did he say is he in the car all right let's go Gorgeous farm girls.
and don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.